everything that's going on in the world, we could all use a little bit of relaxation and anxiety relief. And that's why I've cooked up this short Pilates routine to help us calm down and relax. How am I supposed to relax while I'm doing Pilates? Well, while I agree that Pilates is a super challenging workout, I also believe every workout doesn't have to kill you. We can use the movements in Pilates and the breathing that we do in Pilates to calm our parasympathetic, ner ner parasympathetic nervous systems down and get to a place where we are more grounded in our bodies and feeling more Zen. We can use the movements in Pilates and the different breathing techniques in Pilates to calm our parasympathetic nervous systems down, which will make us feel more grounded in our bodies, more relaxed, and way less stressed out. And with all that said, let's get moving. Okay, beginning on the mat, go ahead and roll yourself down to lie flat. Let's begin by taking a big breath in and then just hugging your knees into the chest. Breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. And I'll start to just deepen your breath here. Making sure that each breath you take is full and each exhale you take is full. And we'll take three more breaths here. Go ahead and let your eyes close. Two more breaths. last breath in and last full breath out and at the edge of that exhale go ahead and just curl up hugging into a super small ball position working those abdominals and you can hug those knees into the chest tightly so that your tailbone rolls off the mat and go ahead and just rock from side to side giving your back a little massage on the floor And from there, you can lie your head back down. From here, we'll set up for a no pumping hundred, 10 deep breaths in our curled up hundred position. So we'll lift the head, neck, and shoulders, send the legs out, send the arms out, and just breathe. Breathing in, two, three, four, five, and out, two, three, four, five. Inhale, and exhale. Inhale and exhale and now while you hold this position focus on the position focus on the details you're curling up pulling the waist in even deeper every time you exhale stretching those arms long keeping your chest super wide open your legs glued together in the center stretching out long and strong breathing in we have about three more breaths and exhale, two, three, four, five. Long, deep inhale. And exhale, two, three, four, five. One more time. And exhale, two, three, four, five. Hold, hold, hold. And then go ahead and fold those knees back in. And go ahead and just rock side to side, look from side to side, shaking all of that out. And then we'll rock and roll up to sit to do some half roll downs, lifting tall through the spine. Big deep breath in. Exhale, round your back. And then start to roll slowly down. And we'll go all the way down through the spine today, working on articulation. And then inhale at the top. Now from here, we'll reach the arms all the way up and back. Big breath in. And then exhale, send the arms forward to the backs of the thighs to, to start again. Rolling up, lifting your head up. Just working that articulation, working the details to take our mind off of everything but what we're doing with our body right now. Big breath in, lift up tall. 
Exhale, round your spine. Roll down slow for three, two, one. Big breath in, reach your arms back. Exhale, lift your arms forward. Lift your head up, rolling up. Rounding over. Lift up really tall through your spine and send it down. Just think of this as nice, gentle, easy movement. Engaging that core, yes. Letting your core work hard, yes. But also letting everything move nice and easy. Arms reach forward, head lifts. Roll up slowly through your spine. Climbing up the backs of those legs till you come to a round shape. And lift up really tall, breathe in. Exhale around one more time. Send it slowly down to the floor. Lower, middle, upper back. Now reach your arms back and then circle them around. Exhale. Just drawing circles with the arms, focusing on the breath. Exhale as you circle around and down. Inhale, reach up and back. Exhale, circle around. One more, inhale, reach up and back. Exhale, circle around. And now we reverse. Inhale, open up. Exhale, send those arms forward. Four more, inhale, open. Exhale, circle. Three more times. Open up. Paying attention to the body, just centering, pulling those low abdominals in as you circle the arms, keeping your trunk stable. Exhale to reach forward. Let's do one more circle. Open out to the side, big breath in. And exhale, send your arms forward and down. From here, let's stretch the legs out along the mat and hug your right knee into the chest. Now from here, we'll take the hands behind the thigh and just stretch it up to the ceiling for a nice hamstring stretch. Breathe in here. And then exhale, bend the elbows to the side to pull the leg towards you. Two more breaths, inhale. And exhale, pull that leg in. One more breath here, inhale. And exhale, pull the leg in closer. And now we'll take that leg all the way up to 90 and then place your palms flat down to the mat. From here, we'll concentrate on the ceiling and stand on the sky with your foot. And I want you to draw a big, not a big circle, but maybe the size of like a cantaloupe or a super large grapefruit, a really small circle with the foot, with that heel crossing over and around and up. Just concentrate on making that circle really small and controlled and everything in the body is really steady and still. Just work the stillness as the leg circles small. And crossing and around and up to the top of the circle. One more time. Cross and around and up. And now go ahead and reverse to the outside, drawing that circle around and lifting. Try not to make it too big. This one is small and controlled. Two more. One more time. Good, hold the top. And then go ahead and hug that knee into the chest. Ah. All right, from there, stretch it long. We'll take that left leg in. Go ahead and give it a nice big hug. Reach the leg up to the ceiling. Big breath in here. And now exhale, pull the leg in towards you for a hamstring stretch. And inhale, tapping into that breath again. And exhale, try to relax everything as you stretch this leg. Inhale. And exhale, pull it toward you. Good, now reach that leg up to the ceiling. Place your palms flat down on the mat and start to draw that small cantaloupe-sized circle. 
four more circles, crossing and around to lift. Inhale, down, and exhale. Two more. One more small controlled circle. And now reverse to the outside. I feel like just drawing a circle, anything that's circular is automatically relaxing because it just keeps going around nice and easy. One more time. Hold that leg up there and then go ahead and hug it into your chest, giving it a nice stretch. Good. From there, we'll hug both knees in and then rock and roll all the way up to sit tall on your mat. Spine stretch forward. So now we'll separate the legs, toes up to the ceiling, and reach your arms forward, lifting really tall through your spine. Now inhale, grow taller through the crown of your head, and exhale, drop that head down, rounding through your spine to stretch forward. Go ahead and reach as far as you can. We'll take two deep breaths here, big breath in, and exhale to deepen that stretch. One more time, inhale, and exhale. And now inhale, pull those abdominals in. As you exhale, roll up the rest of the way. Just keeping the breath flowing, big breath in, lift tall. And exhale, round over, pulling the low belly in, stretching those arms out with energy, big breath in. And exhale, deepen the stretch. Nice round C curve in the spine, big breath in. And exhale, deepen that C curve. Inhale as you roll up slowly. And exhale, roll up the rest of the way, lifting really tall through your spine. Big breath in, lift even more through the sides of the waist. Last time you stretch over, dropping that head down as you exhale. Rolling through the spine to reach forward. Big breath in here. And exhale, reach a little bit further. One more time, big breath in. And exhale, reach all the way out and over. Keep the breath flowing as you roll up. Go ahead and lift up really tall through that spine here. Relax the shoulders down, and then go ahead and relax your arms down. From here, we'll walk the feet together, and then roll yourself down to the mat. And when you get to the bottom, go ahead and place your feet flat down on the mat with your heels together, your toes slightly apart. We'll do an exercise called breathing. So here, we'll reach the arms up to the sky. And now let's breathe in, arms go down, hips go up. Hold your breath while you're up here. Three, two, one. And now exhale deeply, roll your spine down as you lift your arms, beginning position. Inhale, palms down, hips up. Hold there, opening the chest. Three, two, one, work the breath, slowly lowering down through the spine as you lift the arms, floating them to the sky. And again, inhale, press down, hips up. Hold it, three, two, one. Exhale, melt that spine down as you lift the arms. One more time, big breath in. Hold there, hips up, palms down, three, two, one, and deep exhale as you slowly melt down through the spine. From here, we'll continue working that breath. So the elbows touch down to the mat. The knees pull into the chest for coordination. Now, this one takes a lot of concentration. So now we'll just lift the head, neck, and shoulders up. Inhale, arms out, legs out. Hold your breath. As you hold that breath, open the legs. Squeeze them together. Exhale deeply, knees into chest. Elbows bent. Lower your head down. Usually we don't lower in between, but today we're doing Pilates for relaxation. So look from side to side. And we'll do that again. Concentrating. Head, neck, and shoulders lift. Big breath in. 
arms and legs out, hold your breath. Open, squeeze the legs together, exhale, knees pull in, elbows bent. Lower your head, look to one side, look to the other side. Look to center, curl up, big breath in, arms and legs out, hold your breath, open, close, exhale, knees into the nose, elbows bend now, stay curled up, let's go a few more, inhale, reach out, hold the breath, open, close, exhale, knees into the nose, elbows bend, one more, inhale, reach out, open, close, exhale, knees into the nose, elbows bend, go ahead and lower your head, neck and shoulders down, all right, and from there, we'll flip to the belly, for some neck roll. So just thinking about relaxing your neck and your shoulders here. Let's keep the legs slightly apart today, but keeping the seat tight. Squeeze the seat so that your hip bones push down into the mat. Really long back of neck here. So now your hands are gonna press down into the mat and lift the chest up until your elbows are at a 45 degree angle. Now work on opening your chest here. Let's look over your right shoulder. Relax. As you drop your chin down to your chest, drawing a big, giant circle until you look over your left shoulder. Look straight ahead and reverse the circle, look left. All the way down and around to your right shoulder. Look towards the center and center to lower all the way down. Turn your head to one side, rest your cheek, shake your hips from side to side to relax that low back. Go again. Now we turn the nose down to the floor, press into the hands, abs tight, seat tight. This time look to the left, big circle all the way down and around to the right. Look center, look to the right, all the way down and around to the left. Look center. Lower down, down, and down. Turn your head, rest the cheek down, shake your hips from side to side. We'll do one more. Nose down to the floor. Big breath in, lift off. Look to the right. Circle down and around to your left. Look to the center. Look to the left. Circle down and around to the right. Look to the center and lower all the way down. Go ahead and sit back onto your heels for a stretch. We'll round out the back and walk your fingertips out as far as you can. Three deep breaths here. In with the air. And out with the air. In with the air. And out with the air. One more breath in, in with the air, and out with the air. Go ahead and roll yourself forward, coming to a plank pose. Heels together, toes slightly apart. And now from here, we'll just lift the hips up and back and drop your heels down. Well, now we'll make our way back to our toes by just walking the the hands backward. And when you get here, just drop your head down, standing on two legs. You can soften your knees if you need to. Dropping your head down heavy. And we'll start some roll-ups here. Pulling into the abdominals. I'm gonna come forward so you can see better. And now just soften the knees slightly as you pull into that powerhouse in and up. And start to roll up through your spine for four. Three, two, one. And back down again, chin to the chest, rolling through that spine. Three, two, hold the bottom hanging down to stretch. Breathe in. Breathe out. Soften your knees and roll up four. Heavy arms, three, two, Head is the last thing to lift. And exhale, chin to the chest to roll down four. Three, two, hang down heavy, one. Big breath in at the bottom. 
and exhale. Soften the knees to roll up through the spine. Four, three, two, one, and roll down. Four, three, two, one. Last time to take a big breath in at the bottom. And exhale all of the air. Soften your knees and slowly roll up through that spine. And then stand tall at the top of your mat. And there you have it. A little bit of Pilates for some relaxation and anxiety relief. I hope that you're feeling a little bit more grounded in your body and a little bit more relaxed than when you started. Thank you so much for joining me on the mat today and watching this video. If you have any questions at all about what we did today or Pilates in general, feel free to drop them below in the comments or shoot me a DM on Instagram at Terriel Samuels. And if you got a good workout, if you feel more relaxed, if you had fun, or if you learned something, go ahead and hit like, hit subscribe, and I will see you on the mat next time.